Driving around town, you may notice that almost every business and restaurant has closed down given all the snowy and icy conditions. Almost all being the key words. News Channel 5's Chris Davis joins us elsewhere. If the lights ever turn off, we know we're in big trouble. That's right, Carrie. You know, we never got to see the sun today. It was completely blocked off by all the clouds and the snow. But is it a coincidence that this sign has that same soft yellow inviting glow as the sun? It brings a tear to your eye, doesn't it? Waffle House is always open, and that's by design. There's even a thing called the Waffle House Index. It's used by FEMA kind of unofficially to judge how severe a storm is. So like you mentioned just a moment ago, Carrie, if we don't see those lights on, we know we're in big trouble. Good news is they are on. Tell you what lights aren't on tonight, and this may be a surprise to some of you, Whataburger out in Hermitage. They opened officially yesterday. They always try to stay open as much as they can. They're known for kind of that same index too, but they decided this afternoon around 1:30 to call it quits. Go ahead and send their employees home. They had to cut off the drive through line at a certain point, so some hired security guards had to be the bearer of bad news and tell people, eh, I know you're in line, but you can't get Whataburger today. People we spoke to were on both sides of that dividing line. Listen. I mean, I said, oh, man, they're cutting off the line, so I'm the very last guy. So, yeah, here I am. Just coming by to see if I can get in here because it's snowing. I figured the line wouldn't be wrapped around Lebanon Road, so I figured I'd come up here and try it. I tell you, the line is long inside the lobby here at this Waffle House on Dickerson Pike. They're not seating any customers tonight because they're actually a little low staffed between the great resignation and also the road conditions are just hard for employees to come in. So they're doing to go orders only. Keep that car running if you come out here so you can keep your food warm too. But you know, probably something in the kitchen isn't a bad option tonight either. At least you don't have to get out in all of this extreme cold. We'll send it back to you guys.